right, so now we'd like to welcome Coach Vosberg, who is the head coach from St. John Fisher College here to the in. show. Thank you for having me. Thank, right. thank you so you. much for coming. It's really exciting to have you. So thank can you. you tell us a little bit about the different and what size school you coach and the different levels there are at that kind of coaching level? Yeah. Um, I'm at St. John Fisher College. We're a Division III uh, football program. We're a Division III school okay. for all sports. And uh, in Division III sports, uh, you don't have any athletic scholarships. Okay. Then if you go up to the different levels, Division II has so many scholarships and that, and then Division I has the most. So right. that's what separates the schools a lot of times. A lot of times they, people think it's how big your school's enrollment right, is. It's not, it has nothing to do with enrollment. There are oh. schools our size that do give out athletic scholarships okay. and, and so on. And then there are schools that are uh, large schools that don't give scholarships. So yeah. it, it doesn't make any, it's how much money you want to spend on scholarships. If you don't want to spend any money on athletic scholarship, you're going to be a Division three school. If you okay. want to give up uh, so many this amount, then you could be a Division two school. And if you want to be a Division one, you can give up to this many wow. um, scholarships. I think that's so it's, all, it's all based on money. Sure. That's yeah. a common misconception. Yeah. yeah. So I also heard you talking about recruiting. So what does it mean for a student to be recruited by a college? What is that? Well, usually it, it entails that a coach in whatever sport, like our sport football, will go into the high schools and find out who the best players are. Uh, and that and then we will try okay. to get a hold of them and talk to them at their school we mm -hmm. will go and visit in their school we'll get them down to the guidance mm -hmm. office or the athletic office we usually try to fi figure out before we call them down to the office though we do try to find out first academically are they going to be a fit for our school mm -hmm. because it's nice to be a fit football wise sure. but if you're not a fit academic wise then I'm wasting that kid's time and and uh, and so on so uh, we actively will go in and uh, visit with the kids uh, we'll call them up on the phone we will email them we will text them we'll invite mm -hmm. them to campus sure. and so there's a lot in the recruiting process the rec recruiting process is a long process too a lot of kids don't realize that till they get uh, start getting recruited that we're, we're recruiting juniors right now mm -hmm. okay. for next Next spring at this time, hopefully we'll sign a bunch of good ones, but we're <laughs> out there trying to find them now. Right. Uh, the Division One schools will even go 10th grade. They'll go 10th grade, wow. ninth grade, and start talking oh, kid to that, kids. That's going to play at that level already is done demonstrating that capability. Right. And so they'll start to get after those kids. So uh, recruiting is a long process for the kids and, and, and so on. And uh, okay. it, it varies a little bit because there are schools that they can't visit kids at, at schools. Right. They can't okay. go to a school and visit uh, and that. So, so go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Alright, so realistically, what's the possibility that a student's going to go to a college and play sports on a, on a scholarship? Not good. Okay. <laughs> Not good. <clears throat> only about 8% of all high school athletes go on and play a sport in college, at least for one year. That's right. only 8%. Of that percentage, uh, to get like a Division I football scholarship, uh, all the high school football players in the country, and there's two million of them, wow. or mm -hmm. excuse me, one million of them, only about 2% wow. ever get football scholarships right. at the Division I level. Yeah, which is it, not it, a lot. That's not a lot. <laughs> that's not a lot. And so the chances of a kid coming out of high school to get a Division I scholarship, it's not good. But it's academic really, scholarships. There's more money in academics. Right. I always talk to kids about that. There are a lot more money in academics than there is so in you athletics. You've got to keep the grades up. You've got to keep the grades up. And the other thing that happens with the grades, and the statistics show it, <clears throat> those kids that will do well academically have twice the chance of getting recruited. Mm -hmm then the kids don't have very good grades, even if they're good athletes. Right. So that Those has to do with what, the, on the video, talking about work ethic? Yes. So having a good work ethic that you see in academics, academics right. that you're, that's a flag to people saying like, oh, this, this is, kid's a, a good student, so you must have some self-discipline. Right. And yeah, and he's a kid you can depend on that's going to be there for four years for you. Mm -hmm. right. You know, you go recruit a kid that's not a really good student, then you're playing the game of, is he going to make it from one year to the next, from mm -hmm. semester to semester? And uh, you would like to be able to say, this kid's going to make it. He's a good student. He'll be here for four years. He'll help our program. So a kid could play college ball in, in a Division three school, but 
they can also, they could do it, they wouldn't have an academic scholarship, I'm sorry, they wouldn't have a sports scholarship, but they could have an academic scholarship. So they shouldn't be like, oh, I can't get, I can't right. get a sports scholarship. But they can get an economic right. scholarship and still continue to play a sport once right. they get recruited that right. they love and enjoy. Exactly. Awesome. Uh, there's more Division three football programs in the country than there are Division one. Okay. In fact, we outnumber them two to one. Okay. Right. So your chances of playing Division three football right. are greater than playing Division one. Right. So football. keep those studies up so you yes. can get that academic yeah, Coach scholarship. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for, for having me. Thank, Thank you. you. It was really interesting. Thank, Thank you. you.